What is up, everybody? Big Ox Triple Six here, and check it out. E3 is just a few weeks away, and I can't wait for that to freaking start, which will be on a Sunday, which kind of sucks, but whatever. And there's always some rumors and speculations always going around before E3 hits. And to me, this is probably fake, but take it as a grain of salt. Okay, I, I really don't believe this is happening. You probably saw the article, you know, the title in the video. But to me, honestly, I don't think it's going to happen, but I'm going to read it anyway. It says, report, Sony will reveal its new handheld at E3 2017 and will be a successor to the PlayStation Vita. And I'll leave my two cents after this article. But um, here we go. Nintendo launch Nintendo Switch, a hybrid handheld home console a couple months ago and it looks like it's been quite successful now it seems that looking at nintendo's hybrid console success sony might be also thinking of tucking trying its luck again in the handheld market as a rumor has has made its way to the internet that suggests that the company might showcase a new handheld at e3 2017 this report comes from a Chinese games media site who claims they have received an invitation to to the pres um, presentation of a new gaming hardware reveal at Sony China office, according to report. This will be very, very first presentation of Sony's new handheld. According to the report, the handheld will be a PSP3, which will be, be revealed at this year E3 presentation and will be a successor to the PlayStation Vita, which they only made one PSP. And I don't consider the PlayStation Vita as another PSP. I don't know, that's just me, but but moving on. Um, it will be interesting to see a new handheld console to complete with Nintendo Switch. However, take this as a rumor, a grain of salt, people. That's what it says. No official statement has been released. While Sony might be looking to compete with the Switch, but it's just a matter of a couple years down the line, according to the industry analyst, Michael Pachter. Um, consoles will move off... What, the what? Console software will soon move off the console by, by 2019. I don't know. That's just whatever, whatever it says. Um, the source is from typical NeoGAF. Okay, I have a PlayStation Vita right here, and I have Borderlands 2 inside of it. And I made my overall thoughts for Borderlands 2 um, Vita version. I'll leave that in the link in the description below. But it won't ever top Nintendo's handheld. I love, I love Sony. I love their handhelds. I love the PlayStation Vita. It just came out late because smartphones were coming out when they first launched and also the pricing of the vita and the memory cards as well and there's the memory cards are still freaking pricey but they're not going to top nintendo's marketing um handheld marketing no way because it caters mostly to children my my best friend has a has a nintendo 3ds hit her husband has a Nintendo 2DS. Her uh, younger kid has a Nintendo 2DS. None of them has a PlayStation Vita except, no, I'll take that back. Her, her husband has a PlayStation Vita and he plays it, he plays the PSP more than this. And I'm just like, I mean, it's, it's whatever, you know. It has more third party games Talking about Nintendo here, the Nintendo 3DS has more third-party games compared to this, and exclusives as well, you know. But this is more the Japanese audience because most of the games that they have have on here, you can also play on a PS3 or PS4. Borderlands 2, you can play on on a PS4. But before that, this was on a PS3 or Xbox 360. They don't have any like hardcore exclusives on this handheld. Like really hardcore exclusives that, that I know of, that I want to play. I have a bunch of games that's on here, but most of the games 
are Japanese or um, Monster Hunter um, related games like that. And I'm not a big fan fan of those type of games. You know, that's just me. But it's a good system. I really do like it. I prefer this over, you know, the um, PSP. Even though PSP had a bunch of good games too. But I really don't think um, Sony will be showing this at E3. I'll be shocked. But honestly, I don't think they'll be doing this. Because they still have the, the PS4 selling like crazy. And also... The, um, they haven't even talked that much about PlayStation VR. You know how if you if you've been with Sony, you know how Sony is. If it's not if if it's not working well, they'll you know shove it underneath the rug and forget about it. No, you don't hear them talking about um, PlayStation. Well, I think it's PlayStation now. They're very barely talking about that that type of stuff, even though that stuff is way overpriced. That's just me, but I don't believe this is happening because Nintendo has a handheld market, but just have the handheld market, just period. You know, that's why you'll see Microsoft even doing it. But I just want to let you guys know about this, about this so-called rumor with the grain of salt. But let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about, you know, Sony doing a new handheld revealing the new handheld at 2017 E3 which I can't wait for that to freaking happen that's that's like freaking amazing day for me and I love taking my vacation time because I get to see most of the games that they that they show and I just I just love it Super Bowl for gamers people Super Bowl for gamers but anyways if you like the video give it a thumbs up um, if you didn't give it a thumbs down and stay awesome guys and I'll see you guys next time thanks for watching